What's up guys, Jason here from Little Blog of Horror, here to tell you a little bit about Diary of a Horror Nerd, a little YouTube series we decided to do, and uh, wanted to include you guys, just basically four simple questions, we'll have the link below so you can read about it, and uh, basically, you know, what got you into horror, you know, why you love horror, uh, how horror has uh, impacted your life, and uh, basically, you know, what what the world needs to know about the horror fans. So, I'm going to kick things off here, tell you a little bit about how I got into horror. All started with uh, me and my dad sitting around watching movies when I was a kid, and uh, one of the first movies that I remember watching with my dad would have been this one right here, Chud. Great fucking cult classic 80s fucking film. Cannibalistic humanoid underground dwellers. It was uh, quite an experience, you know, the pretty much the first horror movie I remember watching. And uh, quite, the, uh, quite the impact there. Another one of my first was uh, Texas Chainsaw Massacre, the original, of course, and uh, watched that one uh, down in Georgia. I was at my grandmother's house, I believe, and uh, one of my cousins brought it over, and that was pretty much another one of the firsts. And uh, to that, uh, pretty much took off from there. Uh, got into uh, Got into Halloween, right here, original VHS. Got into Halloween, of course, Friday the 13th. Those two became my favorite franchises. And pretty much, you know, the reason that I love horror today. Also, like, as a kid, I always remember going into, like, the video stores, seeing all the you know the, the covers for the for the movies and everything was always such such an experience for me you know just getting to go in there and I always ended up in the horror section you know looking at the different covers to the movies I mean I can remember you know just seeing ones like the howling you know with the the claws coming through the through the wall and everything on the cover and you know the Nightmare on Elm Street covers with Freddy and they were just all just made a huge impact on me I just was like man I wanna wanna watch this movie and you know eventually I ended up watching all of them <laughs> so and actually as a kid in elementary school I dressed up as Freddy several years in a row I was I was always Freddy because I loved like I loved having the glove and you know just thought he was this just the most badass <laughs> fucking killer and uh but that's that's just another one of one of the you know the things that led to me being a horror fanatic so hell yeah so basically you know why I love horror is just because I mean I really can't explain it it's it's just a love of the genre and just the the movies you know going in you just you never know what to expect and it's just it's just a thrill ride every time so I mean whether it be anything classic horror love it all you know from the classics to some of the more recent recent stuff so but my favorites would have to be you know the classics not really into too much of the recent stuff so. don't hate it don't get me wrong but. and uh, how has horror impacted my life uh, pretty much it's become it's become a lifestyle from collecting to going to conventions it's it's become a lifestyle I mean we usually hit quite a few conventions a year um, it's become 
the, the Friday the 13th franchise has become something that I'm going to cosplay as Jason. That's going to be fucking fun as hell. I can't wait to do that. And, man, just, I mean, going to conventions and everything, you, until you go and, you know, experience the stuff and the people, and, I mean, it's just, a, it's like a huge family. I mean, there's so much to do at conventions. There's so many cool things, you know, that you can buy that you can't find anywhere else. And, uh one of the benefits of going to like a horror convention and stuff like that you know meet up with your friends hang out and just check out all the horror stuff and the, you know the actors everybody you know everybody that's there it's just it's fucking amazing you know it's a, it's a great fucking time and uh, you know I enjoy it tremendously I can't wait to go to the next one which will be Scarefest down in Kentucky, Lexington, Kentucky, so fucking be there. Um, pretty much that's it for me, uh, so if you want to follow me, check out the fucking links below, Twitter, Instagram, everything will be there. We want your videos, so check out the link below and uh, read up on it. If you want to be part of this, we'll get you on, send your video in, and uh, we hope to see you guys. You know, fucking rock on, you guys. Fucking horror family fucking kicks ass. Later. <laughs>